Hello, spellcasters and spider monkeys. My name is TV Skyne, and welcome back to Legends of Runeterra, where we're going to be continuing along the trajectory we've already set ourselves on and play yet another fun gimmick deck that was sent to me by someone in the comments. In this case, we're going to be playing Kill King's Counterfeit Copies deck. Now, Kill King themselves called it Scam Mushroom because that's it's a mushroom deck, sort of, but it doesn't include Teemo, just to kind of fake people out, I think. Um, and the way that this deck apparently works is that for most of the early game, you're just going to be stalling. Like, you're not even going to be trying to... You're just going to be stalling, trying to build up a board state where you can remove whatever enemies are putting down. And you're aiming for a particular board state by the late game. You want a Cloud Drinker on the board, as well as a Karma, preferably a leveled up one. Um, and you want preferably also a puff cap peddler on board if possible. And at that point, you're going to use the burst spells cost one less thing from the cloud drinker to make your counterfeit copies and rummage free. Um, especially the counterfeit copies. You counterfeit copy your counterfeit copy in order to just get like pretty much an infinite cycle of pretty much free spell casts, which are then used to trigger the various spell effects that are available in the deck otherwise. Especially the Puff Cap Peppler, obviously, who like offers a hell of a lot of of the pain and damage if you can get that thing going, but also stuff like um the eye of the dragon who can summon a crap ton of dragonlings for you. Um the Claws of the Dragon, which becomes a free summon if you cast a couple of spells, and then there's, of course, Deep Meditation here. Like, just basically just using a bunch of spell-activated effects to do things. Now, I don't have the mind for spell-casting decks. Like, I don't really have the mind for those... Like, there's a reason why the decks I prefer to play are stuff like Deep and Poro decks, because I just... I have big thing on board, go smash, smash, smash face, hit them hard. Like, that's that's kind of where my brain is at. That's what I'm good at. Um, so I'm curious to see whether I can make this work. But we're going to give it the old college try. And if it doesn't work, well, that's not Kill King's fault, I promise you. And if you want to try this deck out yourself, as usual, you'll find the code for it down in the description. And if you can do better than I can, uh, you, you know what? Like, record it. Send it to me on Twitter. I'd love to see, like, someone pull off a, a successful version of this nonsense because I am not confident at all that I'll be able to but we'll give it a try so theoretically I'm not supposed to be using counterfeit copies early on I want to have it in hand but I don't necessarily want to be using it early uh, because I, 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 I the card draw is good um, or the, the, the effect is good but what I really want is to be able to counterfeit the counterfeit so we'll we'll restrain ourselves at the start here. We got a couple of eyes of the dragon out though. The uh, that's not good. Uh, more of the question that I have is whether... I mean, they can't do any damage back to it. They can block it one time. I feel like I'd rather save up the spell mana right now. Because Mystic Shot isn't going to do jack shit to that. Well, it is going to do jack shit, but... <sighs> Let's draw a spell. The River Shaper, to me, has always looked so much like a Magic the Gathering card. Like... Uh, that's not great. Uh... Do I want to do rummage? Yes, that's actually good. Go away. Okay. I think that was an okay play. I'm not sure. Anyway, give me my my card draw. A gift from the river folk. Another rummage. Okay, that's less useful right now. Hmm. Okay, let me think. Because I'm tempted just to go for the card draw. 
But I could also put that down. Yeah, but then I'd have to discard to get the Dragonling out. I'd rather not do that. That's better, actually. By the strength of our convictions. Don't want to discard two right now. All the cards I have seem a little bit too valuable to discard. For the moment. Okay. So I can either get the Karma out, or I can get more card draw going. Uh, it's a Demacia Ionia player, so... They probably can't kill Karma as such. Like, so long as I don't put her in danger. Oh, no, no, they can. They totally can. They can kill the Karma. That's great. Okay. Should probably have taken, just used the Shadow Assassin to hit them in the face, but oh well. Hey! That's not useful. Uh, what can I do? I mean, I can give them, give Karma plus one plus zero, but that doesn't do anything to save her. So the only thing I could do is discard the investigators. I can deal three to that thing. At least I'll trade out with it. I think that's the best I can do right now. I can at least get rid of it, but... Uh. Like, if they're gonna kill my karma, I want to at least... And I'm just gonna use counterfeit copies on the counterfeit copies. The spirit gives to those who listen. And get her out. The Vanguard stand as one. Because that should let Be her strong. summon a dragon link. Yeah. Dark times. <sighs> Good. And now... Cloud Drinker, and then I can get my Deep Meditations out. Ready for deployment. Okay, this this is starting to work. Uh, well, might as well go with the Dragonling immediately and get the Elusive to attack as well. Oh, piss off. I have more Cloud Drinkers in the deck, and I've gotten a lot of the effect out of it. But that still sucks. And I got the Life Steal from the Dragonling, which is good, because I'll get that next turn as well. Yeah, that's not great. I need more removal. I can't do jack shit to block any of that! Okay, what can I do? I can block three of that damage. By killing that. And then I can block Cythria with the lifesteal and get a little bit of life back.
Okay, so this must be incredibly annoying for my opponent that I just keep <laughs> doing stuff, but I'm not confident that I'm confident that I'm gonna win. I'm still my brain is still trying to keep up with the mental gymnastics of how the hell to make this shit work. So we'll see, because they've got a bunch of big fat Demacia bastards. Oh, piss off! Really? Okay. I'm not gonna get the Dragonling, though. Not that round. Oh, yes, I am. Cool. Let's just get you on the board immediately. It's not like I've got anything better to spend my mana on. I need card draw! The four Demacia is gonna kill me. It's gonna end me. <laughs> yeah, I'm dead. I sort of, kind of, almost ish got the thing to go off, but that. As Demacia wills it. Not even gonna give me time, and they don't need to anyway. Yeah, that's fine. Call that a practice run. Honestly, I should have waited with the Cloud Drinker. Like, I should have just given them time to spend all the mana they had in hand. Oh, no. No, wait. No, no, because that was the next turn that they did that. Yeah, whatever. Boy, that deck sure has a lot of champions in it. Uh, I'd like to have the removal available. What are they crying about? Oh, they had a bad opening hand with nothing to play. Yeah. I know that feel, bro. Ah, there's the man of the hour. Sure. I can't get rid of progress day. I'm just gonna have to take that damage to the face. Wait, what can I discard? I could discard the Karma, but that would not... Like, that wouldn't be a great idea. I'm gonna hit the Puff Cat Peddler instead. Which I don't think is ideal, but... Uh, Eh, uh, well. Hey, another puff cap peddler. How nice. More card draw. Okay. All right. Let's see. I can get a Karma out now, and I have a spare in case I need it. I could also play Progress Day. But that's the kind of thing that you really want to play when you have a leveled Karma on the field. More than that, though, I have that problem. So I'm going to need that spell. I'm going to need that. I need to block the five, which I can. I can sacrifice my Shadow Assassin for that. Oh, you son of a bitch. Okay, I won't. I was going to play this and just to, to create a spell, but for the moment. You cannot escape. Master. We'll do this. I still have a karma. Neener, neener, neener. Discard two to draw two. Could discard the peddler and the veteran investigator, but that feels like a wasteful thing. 
there was a little fella asking for me. I should maybe have just used Progress Day, actually. I am greedy. I want to have Progress Day be buffed by, you know, a Enlightened Karma, but... A Demacian soldier is worth ten foes. Officer J.S. Hawklaw, you did see us. That's a lot of rummage. Okay. Should I just play one rummage and then discard the other two? <laughs> That would be funny. Uh, it'd be a bad idea, too, because they are spell casts, like, so they're useful to have around. There's the counterfeit copies. But I think I'll just use Progress Day now. Discipline and steal! Uh They grow up so fast. Well, there's the cloud drinker. Okay, so I can get the claws of the dragon out with spell casts if I want it to. But again, it's the thing of like which two would I discard for that? I'd rather have a blocker right now. Spring does not pity winter. Beg your pardon. Well, there's three puff caps in there. That's nice. Do I want to block that five, or do I want to keep my? I want to keep my puff cap peddler on board. I'm taking the risk on that five damage. Okay, this had better work now. What do you want to do? With your two for fucking Demasi. Yes, finally. Okay, Cloud Drinker, time to do your thing. Hello, Trindamir. I don't like you at all. Clear your heart. Let your instincts speak. Well, I've already counterfeited copied the counterfeit copies, so... Imagination is not experience, and instinct is no substitute for planning. Okay, so far so good. Can't do anything with all this mana right now. I'm tempted to put... But, like, they just challenge her and kill her, so... Can't put Karma on the board right now. They're gonna want to get rid of the Cloud Drinker for the moment. That's gonna be their priority. Oh, they're gonna use a Fort Demacia, and then they're gonna go for my face, and it's gonna hurt a lot! Ooh... Is that a good idea? See, I don't think it is, because I'd need to discard Karma. But on the other hand, I need the draw. I need the draw. I I need other cards. I need something. I've always been a fun guy. How about 
You're not even gonna do four damage, yeah? And they targeted the <laughs> Puff Cap Peddler because they think it's a Puff Cap deck. Which, you know, fair assumption. Uh, let's get you. Gonna take four plus seven. That's too much damage to take. I can't actually do that. Okay. Okay, I'm not dead yet. <laughs> Probably dead, but not yet. Again, feel free to scream in the comments about all the mistakes I'm making. <laughs> oh, it's an 8-5 Fiora now. That's good. That's lovely. What is when you return malevolence? Well, that's nice. Literally all they're gonna have to do next turn is is go for my face and I'm done because I, I again like there has to be something I'm fucking up here in terms of Getting card draw Because I'm supposed to have a ton of cards in hand by this state of the game at least according to the instructions uh, But I'm not getting there I have no equal Quite right, Fiora. Quite right. <laughs> okay, we'll see what card I draw, but I don't care. Like, whatever card it is, it's not going to do anything for me. No, not really. Anyway, that's the end of that. <laughs> All right, we'll give this another shot. We'll try again. Garen and Fiora. Okay, great. Great! It's not like I haven't been miserably unsuccessful against those up until now. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Hello. This is probably a bad idea, but let's just let's just fucking go hard on card draw this time. Just nothing but card draw. I say as I discard a card that gives me card draw. <laughs> but you know what I mean. Okay. Uh, let's just get the Puff Cat Peddler down, force them to respond to that. I don't know, maybe they have some removal they want to burn. Okay. Well, I mean, yeah, I understand what they're doing there. And I don't have any effective countermeasure against this, by the way. 
at all. I'm just gonna have to let it be a 3-3 on the board forever. And they seem to know that. Uh... Just gonna get rid of that Sith 3 of them. And put some puff caps in their deck. Cause why not? Because then I'll do Rummage, and I'll discard the Cloud Drinker and the Gotcha so I can play Deep Meditation next round. And hopefully draw some more spells, put some more Mushrooms in their deck, and get another Dragonling on the board. Years hoping! Let's see if that works. Well, I got the counterfeit copies now, finally. That's nice. Anyway, next round, please. What is gained when you return malevolence? Okay, not quite what I was hoping for, but fair enough. Uh, give me more card draw. That's annoying. Want the life steal? Might as well take the face damage as well. <clears throat> and that's five damage I can't really do anything about. I mean, I could, I can, yeah, just block it with that with a Shadow Assassin. So that they don't get the power up, but that's about all I can do! Uh, I don't like this. <laughs> Jerk. Get puff capped. At least get puff capped. Oh, this is not going to be good. There's the counterfeit copies, and get rid of you. That gets three damage off the board, at least. Are you going to glimpse beyond it? No, you're going to glimpse beyond Yeah, because you just need to buff those motherfuckers, yeah. That seems to be what their deck is based around, which means, like, if I had recalls, I could completely screw them, but I don't, so I can't. Anyway, get puff capped. at least some puff caps. And since they don't seem to have any challengers or anything, I can probably put Karma on the board. Uh... I 
can't help but feel like this deck needs more karma on the board. Like, that's more what it's built for, to have her generate spells all the time for those spell effects to go off on. But so far, I'm so paranoid about putting the karma down because, well, they just kill her. Like, they just, they just kill her, though. Just give me the lifesteal. Aww. My Meanie. Please don't have another black spear in hand. I can't believe they didn't kill the karma. They must have been so scared of that puff cap peddler. <laughs> Now the question for me next turn is whether I want to get some blockers on board just to avoid the face damage or if I want to use progress day. And I don't rightly know. Hey, a spell. Oh, that's not bad actually. Yeah, I'm in trouble. I fight with my spirits, not my fists. Because like, I couldn't do anything to stop those goddamn things. They come back all the time and they're stronger. Ah. Oh, good. That's wonderful. Redoubled Valor is bullshit. It's bullshit. It shouldn't be in the game. It's bullshit. Let's get some more stuns in my deck, actually, come to think of it. And let's do some card draw. Oh, fuck, that was dumb of me. That was super dumb of me. Well, not that dumb, but it was dumb of me. The dragon binds us. Your lesson begins. It's too late for you. What I wanted to do was to stun Garen, actually failed to do that. I wanted to use Concussive Palm to stun Garen. That was the thing I had actually planned to do, but oh well. Knowledge springs from many sources. This is the best I can do right now. Okay, so I can get two Mystic Shots out. I'd like a Scrap Scuttler, please. And I'd like some more card draw. And a body on board that can block things. So if I live until the next turn, I win. I may have won. Maybe. If I can survive. If I can just live. I may have won. Maybe.
No, I've lost. I've lost. I was close to winning. But I, uh, unless I draw... <laughs> unless I... <laughs> if I get anything that can directly damage the Nexus and it's a burst spell... I can win. The answer lies within. Because I've got eight damage in hand in terms of in the shape of my mystic shots, but all they have to do right now is attack, and I'm done. We do what is right. Ah, uh, okay. Okay. Didn't get the lethal that I wanted. Beauty charms while claws take hold. You act but do not see. Spring does not pity winter. Okay, Karma's starting to go off now, but I need her to go off by doing something. Get me that dragonling, please. Okay. I it's not impossible that I can win this. It's unlikely, but it's not impossible. Cause now I have the means to block the Garen a little bit longer. <sighs> but they're like they're, cause they're gonna get to attack every round from now. Oh god. Ah. This is scary as fuck! <laughs> breathe in, breathe out. We're gonna start with this. I need card draw, please. I could have won this last round, couldn't I? <laughs> it worked! <laughs> Finally! Finally it worked! Oh, Jesus Christ. Holy shit. I'm not sure that was how that deck was supposed to be played, but it won by vaguely doing <laughs> multiple magic. Holy! <sighs> oh, that was tense. It won by vaguely doing magic casty things that I don't know how to do. So, hey, I, I declare victory and I call this video to a close. I'm never playing spellcasting decks again. Uh, please do post me any fun spellcasting decks that you have. Watch me flail around like an idiot and miss lethal. That, that'll be fun. Um, thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, please hit like, comment, and or subscribe in like whatever order and combination that you especially feel like it. The deck list that I've been using in this video is down in the description. I have a per Patreon, I have a merchandise store and a chip jar if you want to use them. You, know, you should feel free to do so. And if you don't want to, that's completely fine as well. Thank you very much for watching. And please remember to wash your hands.